All right, hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome to M Mune Base? Probably Mune Base. Uh, so this is, it's like a weird, like, space, it, it's a space colony, colony management game, but you're a cat. I'm excited to play this. All right, so we're gonna go orange and, okay, I could be a calico. Oh, let's go, let's, let's go. Let's do this. All right, and we are going to be dog. Dog the cat. Uh, let's do tutorial mission, just so I know what's up. It's very cute looking. I love the art style. Welcome to planet Jat84. WSD to move around. While outside, keep an eye on your oxygen and suit power levels at the top of the screen. You also need to eat. Uh, let's see. Where's, so food health. There's some plants over there next to the base. Walk over to them and pick them up. Please. Okay. Right. Is this just going to be to totally silent for this section? Use the plants to craft some food at the workbench. I should probably also make sure I'm playing the uh, the proper version. As opposed to somehow accidentally uh, loading up like the, the non-beta version. Okay, so... I don't know how we get O2 back. And I might have to go turn on some of my own music. Oh, this is the base. Okay, so... Nope. All right. Plants, craft, workbench. Gotcha. Plant slop. Gross. Okay. Left click the food in your inventory to eat. Or is it right click? Okay. You ain't. You ate plant slop. Your base refills your suit power. Uh, so we just have to click. So we have a limited supply of oxygen, but this one has an air cleaner that keeps producing more. You can pick up and move base modules to arrange them however you want. Holding down right click will pick it up. Uh, sort of. Okay, there we go. Now go outside, equip the module you just picked up, and right-click on an empty area to place it. Wait, I can't... I can't put it back down? I guess it has to be an empty area. Modules placed adjacent, adjacent to another and share their power and oxygen supply. How do I... You can also drop items from your inventory. Uh, try dropping the scrap. And pressing the Q key. Finally, around the world you will find strange objects you'll need to collect and process these into the research lab to unlock new tech upgrades. This button opens the tech upgrade menu and lets you see all of the artifacts you've discovered. Excellent, that's all for now. Good luck. Wow. Okay, so we're just gonna save and quit. Let's go, let's do new. Or load? I guess we'll keep, we'll, we'll stick on the tutorial for the time being. Ten days left. Oh, I see. So this whole thing is a tutorial. Oh, we need a different tool to pick pick this up. Well, for the time being... Oh, I just need to be next to it to, to deal with that. So, we're low on oxygen. So let's, let's refill on that while we're here. We're decent on food. I guess I'm going to go turn off music. I don't know if the music is going to come back. But if it's going to be non-existent here, then we might as well listen to our own instead. We should probably... Okay, we are paused. That's good. What game soundtrack do we want to listen to when we play this? Let's do Monument Valley for a while. I was listening to that previously and it's a decent, decent soundtrack. Okay, so obviously food, hunger. Okay, so it's got to be down a fair bit more for me to want to grab that. So let's just wander around for a while. I hope we have some sustainability tools in this game paused. Oh, this game is adorable. So we could look at, we could listen to Wander Song. That is, that is valid. So this is just kind of a basic survival game. Not unlike, like, Don't Starve or some other ones. Works for me, honestly. I don't know. I like this kind of game. I kind of wish there were more on the market that were interesting. This one seems at least reasonably... It's got some neat aspects from the beginning. But maybe I'm just kind of, uh, maybe I'm just kind of amused by the, oh, hello, what's this? In communications range of a base. Oh, I see. Okay, so what can we make? Research lab. So we need two scrap, two electronic, uh, smelter, workbench. We've already got a workbench, so we should probably look into this. Can I, can I go smack me up a, a rock? No. So I need a tool to pick this stuff up. Okay, so to get a shovel, we need scrap and axe. Why did it tell me to... 
ditch my scrap metal. I need it. I don't know. Let's see, can I move my face cam to the lower right corner? Yes, that is a good point. It is not... Actually, let me double check. It doesn't matter what corner it's in here. Bottom left or... Uh, either of the bottom corners is, is fine for what I'm doing. What was that? I don't know. Oh god. It got dark. It got dark in a hurry. Uh, do we have to worry about horrible moon creatures? I, this actually concerns me a little bit. Well, I think we'll be okay. Let's start with a crude shovel. Let's see. So let's hang out here. Oh, we don't have any power. So base stats, we're out of oxygen because it is nighttime and dark and okay. So I can't make any light-related stuff. Oh, so this is how I get circuit boards. Well, for the time being, I've got a shovel. I'll move it over here. We've got a seed. Maybe I can plant it over in this? No, it doesn't look like it. Uh, let's just hope night doesn't last too long. No. Okay, so I can pick this up at the very least. Well, this is neat, and it looks like, uh, it looks like it's kind of on a timer, not like a punishing one, but, uh, you know, you, you leave at a certain point. That's not a bad way of doing things. Okay, so we're getting ore. I bet, I bet we can convert ore down into scrap. Let's see. Nope, nothing here. And yeah, I can't, I can't deal with these yet. And good. So night doesn't last terribly long. So there's an axe. We want to make a smelter, but we haven't found enough scrap. Can I make a box? Biofuel generator, component wire, no. Okay, there's some more scrap. Now we do have to worry about durability. That is something to keep in mind. It doesn't it does look like we have to worry about these two. We need a little bit more rock. I hope things don't just disappear. So this reminds me of... It's like a weird cross between Don't Starve with some, like, maybe Subnautica elements. You know, specifically the... Uh, you know, keeping your oxygen above a certain point. I like that. I, I'm i a really big fan of... Oh, what's it called? Uh, I really like oxygen not included, but I don't like the fact that you're managing multiple people. Uh, cause that didn't interest me as much. It wasn't, it's not terrible, but it's just kind of one of those where it's like, I, I just don't, I'd prefer to have one person and I'm just running around trying to, trying to keep everything from dying horribly. How do we plant stuff? I don't know. Oh, and the smelter needs power. Okay, so I'm just going to put that over here. Let's see. There's text that shows up behind your face. I don't know if it's important. Uh, is there? Oh, it's probably when, like, I've picked up stuff. All right, whatever. I'll just move things around. Let's see. So how do we grow these? Okay, so I can make gears. What do we need for a research lab? We need five of this, some electronics. I guess, honestly, I can probably just drop these. I bet they're not going anywhere anytime soon. Okay. Might as well eat this. Yeah, I don't know. We'll... Hopefully learn space farming as we go along. Uh, let's see, so if I want to do electronics, we just need some wire. Okay, solve the wire situation. Let that go for a moment. 
We've got spares, sort of. I guess we should probably eat the other fruit, because I'm going to need all of this. Okay. Wonder, I think you need more power. Absolutely. Unfortunately, we're going to have to get uh, further in this before I can even work on that. Okay, so let's grab one of these. So I need... One more of this, and then just two pieces of scrap metal. And yeah, let's make sure we don't run out of oxygen here. Yeah, the main problem is that the, the furnace is, is making this difficult. I guess let's just grab the roots. Ah, no, 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 no. Okay, we kind of want the pl plants, I think. Okay. There was some scrap up here. So hopefully, these things we can, like, maybe deep drill for. I'm hoping as such. Ooh, more electronics. Okay, so we can make the research lab. I wonder if this is going to have, like, raft-style uh, research, where you just, like, jam stuff in and it kind of tells you what you can get. We should probably also... Ooh. Can I get one more of these? Inventory is full. Well, let's get the research lab down. Okay, so let's get the last of what I can grab. At least at least for a bit, this will get us some more oxygen. All right, we're good. And that won't be made anytime soon. So, what do I need for a biofuel generator? Some more scrap and another gear. Well, that's not out of the realm of possibility. Yeah, I guess there is like a little bit like UH plant scrap. But not sure if that's necessarily something uh, you guys should feel bereft if you miss out on. Either way, this is fine. Uh, let's see. I guess I'll just keep grabbing this. Worst comes to worst. I mean, eventually we should be able to just dig up like... Uh, Really hoping I could like climb into the module and just wait around or whatever. We need storage. We need a lot of things. Uh, it's actually let's go down here and take a look at this. So artifact to research. Oh, okay. So I need to find like an artifact thing. Oh, it's fine, I guess. Uh, let's see. Just jam fruits in our face. Wait for a bit. Might as well make a little bit more plant slop. I'd like to make an axe. Okay, so we've got a smidge of ore. Just gonna let that go for a bit. Right. I need the ore so I can get an oxygen tank so I can actually go on an adventure. Uh, you know what? I... I'll just tear that up there for for a bit. I don't have that much oxygen. We might want that biofuel generator sooner than later. Inventory full cannot collect. Well, I can eat the I can eat the fruit. Grab that. So what do I need for this? Another gear, and then one more piece of scrap. Let's let's go get the biofuel generator. Otherwise, we're gonna run of run out of oxygen. And that would be a small travesty. Hopefully we can just, like, burn grass. Or maybe the fruits? If we can burn fruits, that'd probably be the, uh, the most advantageous. Alright, so biofuel generator. Okay, so we're running low on this. Okay. Close that off. I'm just gonna wait here. Oh, we don't have any we don't have a battery. Oh yeah, I was 
I was dying. Okay, I'm healing slowly, though. It looks like you actually heal based on, uh... On food. Well, I'm not providing anything as I currently am, so let's, let's go grab some more grasses and scrap metal at the very least. I'm just gonna go plonk that there, so it's not sitting in my inventory. Saw some scrap at the very least. Let me see. Are you? This is like a tuber. Yeah, so that's roots. I don't know if I can exactly use that for biofuel. In fact, I'm not actually sure what I can use for biofuel. There's some grass. All right, my HP is back up. Oh, but I don't have any space for grass. Holy crap, you start dying fast if you're running low on oxygen. Oh, cool. So I, I can throw in, um... Extra resources. That's good. Oh. Unfortunately, we need to get more. Okay, so what do I need for that oxygen tank? One piece of metal. To make the inventories full. Okay, so let's... Make one more of these. I will gladly take this oxygen. It looks like it doesn't really generate any more as you go along. Okay, so oxygen tank, can I just equip it? Oh! No, I just used it. It's a consumable. Oh, I was hoping it would increase my... my total. Okay, well this looks like this looks like an artifact. Plus one artifact, okay. I guess we might as well grab grasses along the way. I wanna be able to do farming or something if I can. Am I taking damage by being out here? It doesn't look like it. So that's, that's a good sign. This is neat. I like this quite a bit, actually. I guess let's eat our plant slop. I should probably switch over to a, a fruit-based diet. And you are out of juice. Oh, no. Not what I was going for. Alright, so we have no more power. And I don't know where my generator went. There it is. I'm gonna put it out there. Maybe it'll maybe it'll connect. Click the flashlight. Let's see, it does use suit power. I don't know if that's as big of a deal. Okay. So we have lights on in the base, but no oxygen. Maybe we only get oxygen during the daytime. I'll just make what I can, and okay, so we are we are researching. That's good. I'm just gonna wander around and grab uh, fruit. I'm hoping fruit regrows regularly. Because if it does, that means we can get, uh... Oh. Right. That's not scrap metal. If fruit regrows regularly, we at, we at least have, like, some kind of sustainable source of food? Fuel? And if it doesn't, then I'm gonna have to start panicking. We're kind of sustainable. I mean, it's one of those where I could potentially just sit around, uh, just eating fruits and what little I can gather. 
wood wise while I'm out here. I think I might make some spare oxygen canisters so I can wander around freely. Otherwise, I'm gonna start dying. Oh. I should grab this. And then we should immediately panic and run home as I am about out of oxygen. Oh, show map. Oh, that's neat. Oh, we even turned blue. That's really neat. Why are we out of power? These have oxygen. Nope, we don't have any oxygen. Oh. Oh! The solar panel got dirty. You have to clean the solar panel. Okay, so we get artifacts, we get some research points. And we've got this one as well. So what do we do research... Tech upgrades. Okay, so what can I get? Power. Requires construction. Balls. Uh, it's worth it. I'm gonna have to grab that. Okay, so we've got several of those. And so this lets me get a jackhammer. Breaking up large rocks. Chop down tree-ish things. And a construction yard. As far as more of this. Okay, so now we've got at least a little bit. I am very near death. Could have done that better. At least we'll start healing here and we've got we've got power coming. This time let's let's not risk anything. I'm going to craft 3 of these preemptively. Okay, so we need We need this. We need ore. And then we can look up to, uh, look up, look into breaking larger rocks. Hopefully there's some kind of basic, uh, like a really basic farming system would be lovely with this. I'm assuming there is, considering that we've got all these, like, seeds that we keep picking up. Because if we can get that, then we don't have to worry about nearly as much. Though hunger really isn't a problem unless you're near me and you start, uh, you start really pushing the, the bounds of, like, how much oxygen you have left, which, uh, I'm pretty good at that, and I really shouldn't be. Can you craft a battery? I, that's, I think that's a little bit further down the research tree, but yes, I think I might be able to. I hope they have some kind of equipment system in this game. I'm not betting on it, but it would be nice. You know, increase your maximum oxygen capacity as opposed to using up uh, consumable resources to do the same. Okay, I've got a little bit more. Oops. See the base is up here. Get that. Okay, so we get some more research points. We haven't found another artifact. It's a research log. So we got a fish and... Okay. So construction lets me make buildings and stuff. We can get more power, which might include a battery. I can also do cooking, but that... Cooking, storage, advanced power. We gotta go power. We need it bad. Let me see. So what can I do? I can make a conduit, link up base modules, a biofuel generator, power switch, a battery, and a solar panel. Okay, let's start with the uh, pavement. Oh, walk and drive on. Interesting. Uh, let's do grass. Oh, I see. Two grass will do that. Okay, so it looks like this will fuel the generator, or it'll, it'll fuel some things, but it will not fuel 
the the solar panel or the oxygen production. You can only do that with solar for whatever reason. By the way, we'll get a battery down. Because if we're lucky, we can keep our oxygen production going a little bit. I'll get another solar panel too. Uh, actually, while we're here, day five, six left. Let's uh, let's grab this because it's not helping me. Get another one of these. Power's looking good. What do I need for another solar panel? I need two electronics and two metal. What do I need for electronics? Wire. Okay, so I need to make a several bits of things. I guess we'll just make a bunch of these. Okay. Second wire. Circuit board. Need one more. And then it's just all on, all on the metal. Okay, how are we doing on oxygen? Doing better. And with the battery, uh, we should be able to produce oxygen throughout the entire night. Hey, thank you Meowdry for the sub. And welcome to probably the most appropriate game you could have possibly shown up for. <laughs> okay, uh, let's eat a little bit of food. Craft another solar panel. This way, guaranteed, that battery will remain full. And... This will leave us very little left to immediately do, which is good. Okay, 10 parts. Oxygen is good. Because it really just depends on what the uh, demand is on for oxygen production. Uh, let's see. So an axe for trees. Let's make a jackhammer with what we've got left over. Because I can start working on these rocks. Who knows what we're going to find in them. rocks. I don't know what I expected, but I'm still disappointed. Ah, and radioactive ore do not eat. Yeah, okay, that's good advice. Uh, let's make some plant slop. Okay, so I need to wander around for a bit. Let's see, we're... Okay on food. Your sub in this game have no correlation whatsoever, but it seems neat. It is neat. I... I don't know, I adore survival games, but I adore the more, like, forgiving, interesting ones. Survival games with tech trees are my... Is my... Is... Are my jam. And there need to be, like, more of them. There's, there it is. Okay, let's just eat another one of these. Grab our next artifact. It's raining. I guess it's fine. Uh, let's see. I guess... Oh! Okay, might have to worry about that a little. Let's just go back. Me getting zapped by lightning might not be fatal. But... I don't like the possibility of it being fatal. Okay. Well... Drop that down. Uh, let's see. Can I make a? Can I make another shovel? Cause we should do that. Shovel's done. Research the next artifact. I don't know if I'm gonna want storage or what exactly. Keep making those. Uh, construction yard might not be a bad idea. More complex base and habitat modules. Get some oxygen while we're here. Okay, so it looks like we might want to make another battery at some point. It'll, I mean, no matter what, oh, never mind, we're, use, we're probably using a whole bunch of power just to keep uh, some of these things going. Well, that's fine. Uh, let's see, so do I want to make, yeah, let's make... several of these things. What else do we have that I could get rid of? I've got a boatload of ice. I'm just gonna 
I'm just gonna drop it all down, at least for a little bit. See, my biofuel is out. I'm not really sure if it, uh, how the biofuel works, because it didn't look like it was, it was really, like, shunting any power into my current system. Oh, wow, did we, are we already out of power? We might already be out of power. Well, at least we get more oxygen, but yeah, it looks like the battery's done for the day. So we'll want to get another battery at the very least. Okay. Well, we could just wander around for a while. I mean, if the sun's going to be down, I might as well go looking for more metal and some other things instead of just hanging out there. It doesn't look like there's any any gnarly beasties to show up and bite my tukis, so we can just we can just be And yeah, at some point we'll need that radioactive ore, probably for advanced power. I'm assuming advanced power. Okay, I don't see any artifacts here. So... Actually, we shouldn't even be... We shouldn't even be venturing out. My inventory is... Is quite... Oh, do I have any... No. I don't have any research points. Maybe I did. I don't know. We'll, uh... Go back home for a second. Oh, there it is. Okay, so inventory is full, cannot collect. Oh, suit power offline. Okay, but we can get we can get power back by just going into the base. That flashlight is demanding. Okay, so let's let's make a construction yard. I don't know if it's immediately going to do me a whole lot of good. I'll just plonk it there. Okay, so construction yard will let me make habitat modules, another air cleaner, an airlock, and some lights. The lights might be interesting. Okay, so we get a fish. Cute. I like the little research system. That's that's a neat setup. Okay, so we could do storage. Uh, or we could do cooking. Cooking might let us do some planting. Let's do cooking. Okay, so that's a garden patch. We don't need it as much anymore. I'm just gonna plonk that down. Okay, so... We might as well make one of these. I think I'm probably just going to have, like, a giant, long passageway, at least for a little while. Let's see. Grab metal plates. Right. Grab one of these. Oh, we need water. H2O. Portable water. Oh. Okay, so this might not be as sustainable as I was going for. Uh, let's see. Maybe I should have gotten storage, after all. Well, you know what I could do initially? We might want to just get a second uh, oxygen thing. Just to... Just to increase the amount we can, like, store in the base. Let's see, so what do I need? More electronics. So I need more wire. Inventory is full. Yeah, that's 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 true. In retrospect, I should have paid attention to what these seeds are for. I don't know which ones of them are actually for. I can make another one of these. And I need one electronics, which means I need more wire. Here, make another air cleaner. That way, oh, oh, I didn't realize I was starving. 